Feminism is a way of healing. It's understanding that you come as you are. It's God, it's mother, it's daughter, it's sisters, it's us, that I am feminism, I am life, and that's just about it. We can do anything because the rules are made by us. We, we take the center and we put it right in the middle of our own lives because we say, you know what? We inherited a system that tried to pretend that we could not exist, but we exist. exist. Therefore, we must be magical. Therefore, we can do anything. And that's what queer feminism is for me. It's like the best type of witchcraft, right? Reminding our members that safety is paramount. Are you going to come back alive? Remember, a, a very a good activist is that one who is still alive. But if you're dead, then you won't be able to, to accomplish whatever you dream, dreamed, dreamed of doing. So we have like a, a younger uh, crop of like feminist organizers in Kenya who are amazing. Like Generation Z continues to give me hope like they continue to make me believe that we could actually achieve some of these things in our lifetimes like at times when i'm hopeless i just go on twitter and see like the kids got it we're so dependent on outside forces giving us funding to execute their agendas at the expense of our own lives there's something wrong there's something wrong and so now we have to maybe start asking questions differently in the way CEO power did where we have to ask ourselves, have we internalized their objectives or are we still pursuing our own? And are the objectives that we are pursuing sufficient for our well-being and for our healing and for our wholeness?